Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to discuss about design of electric vehicle battery production system using MATLAB. This example shows how to efficiently charge and discharge a battery for an electric vehicle and uh, until the battery falls. In this example, two circuit breakers are connected uh, with the positive terminal and the negative terminal of the battery to the load circuit. Now let us see the program, MATLAB program. Is there MATLAB live script for battery uh, protecting, protecting the battery charge during uh, discharging and charging for an electric vehicle. Here the table of contents are there. This is a model overview. What does the models are there? In this model, the battery, battery dashboard, lamp indicator and warning indicator dashboard and the plotter window. All these things, these things are there. Here is a battery management system subsystem. It is a sensor subsystem. This is a battery pack subsystem. It is a uh, charger, uh, there is a CC and CV charger. Here, this model overview, this example shows how to efficiently charge and discharge a battery for an electric vehicle and handle the battery faults. This shows a uh, model overview. And then, this is a battery model. Here, a battery model, it comprises a battery pack of 400 volt, generally uh, used in electric vehicles. Here in this example, there are the battery pack in this example comprises 10 models each with 11 series connected uh, and, uh, and this one all models are connected in series to form a pack of 336 and 330 cells. That is the, the third part is mode control dashboard. In an electric vehicle, we can control the charging and discharging operation of the battery. Uh, assume to start the car, the key is turn, turn on uh, which connects the battery circuit breakers and connects the battery to the system of the car. While driving, the battery is in the discharge mode when you connect the car to the charger. The battery is in charging mode. And the, the same thing the, uh, shows the half battery charge and discharge option. Half means that the battery is disconnected. Uh, ba battery means the battery is connected. If you select this one means battery is recharging. These are um, using this now. You can control uh, the, can control the uh, battery by, by using this three uh, indicators here uh, assume this zero means the battery is disconnected on off switch uh, one is means battery is connected here two is uh, two is means the battery is charging three is means the battery is uh, discharging it shows one and half an hour uh, during the simulation you can see the indication lamps uh, shows which mode of the which mode of the battery is currently operating in uh, when the lamps are red uh, the specific mode is off when the lamps are green, the specific mode is on. The model also contains indication lamps uh, that track fault appearances and a reset button is there. Um, when, when you press a reset button, all the faults to be zero for testing purpose. A red lamp indicates the presence of fault. Then the next one is a battery management system sub, uh, subsystem. Here the battery man BMS manages battery operations and keep it in, uh, within the operational limits. And also, for example, uh, for temperature control also there, uh, the um, battery management system control the flow of coolant by using this on-off switch. Uh, the next one is, uh, is for uh, state of charge estimation. There are different uh, ways to estimate state of charge of the battery. In this example, uses extended Kalman filter estimation strategy. And the next block is current limiter block. In this current limiter block, the current state of the battery, such as the battery voltage and temperature, define the over uh, discharging and over charging current limits of the battery for protection of the uh, pack, battery pack. Next one, the simulation part, there is a thermal control block. And the next one is the battery protection logic. The battery protection logic is a state flow uh, logic that takes the battery parameters, sensor data and user inputs, we are give them, we have to give the model parameters value, one, one more uh, script you can see during the simulation. What are the values, what are the uh, cell, cell, uh, cell electrical property and cell voltage and current, uh, current properties, all the things, battery pack, temperature, temperature logic also you can see during the simulation. Then uh, state of charge of the battery and fault, uh, fault analysis of the battery is a battery production logic block, this is a static. Uh, uh, state flow logic block. This is a fault simulation. In this fault simulation, uh, the fault is a fault simulation condition. There are uh, two types of uh, fault simulations are um, assumed. This this one uh, over voltage fault and over current fault is a battery battery pack voltage and thermal faults and battery temperature. Also, you can go, we are going to see. 
fault during battery uh, discharging first one then fault during battery charging in this way you can see let us see the uh, output click on run the start battery plant a model simulation flow is coming the same same way the bam bam the dashboard we can see there is a battery management system and battery pack and the soc estimation block and current limiter block and thermal management block and battery uh, state logic also the, uh, the battery protection logic it takes some more time for uh, compiling you can see here uh, in parallel you can see the output on this right location if you choose this uh, choose here Uh, these are some uh, simlink block in this simlink block again now we are uh, going to see this is a battery uh, uh, relay and this is a charging relay and this is a recharging relay now we are uh, setting on this are running here you can see the plotter plotter um, again there is a display current display and current charging limit you can now we can see the fault simulations are there fault simulation uh, scenario divided into over voltage fault and over current fault this plot uh, during battery charging battery back current also you can see now we can see the scope This was a battery voltage and state of uh, charge estimation and also this temperature maximum and minimum battery temperature it shows. The same thing for another battery scope uh, it shows the uh, charging and discharging current. You see the orange line indicates the current uh, discharging limiter it shows current limiter shows these three uh, values the same thing you can see uh, with this uh, defining the battery model parameters here resource the battery voltage here you see this uh, uh, model parameters value now again it's run the here uh, to uh, second simulation during say, during this discharging battery during uh, discharging operation is showing on now it's a process is running in this live script parallel you can see the output you can see it's a battery pack battery pack current and it's a battery voltage and battery pack current and battery voltage this is for uh, during charging and discharging period for battery voltage battery pack current and battery voltage and battery pack current is for both for is a chv means charging current limit and discharging current limit it's a battery general battery voltage and battery pack current and battery voltage the same thing on you can see with this similar uh, simulink sim sim block you can see these are these are output it now the battery uh, battery pack voltage for during discharging you can see it's a battery voltage and a state of charge estimation and is a temperature battery temperature it shows similarly you can see this current uh, the sensor uh, current limiter sensor outputs you can see now this this happen during discharging also interactive uh, the sim simscape simulation simulation explorer you can see uh, um, yeah, explore simulation results in this you have every subsystem block now you can see this one uh, simscape result explorer block for this particular uh, example called uh, uh, design of battery pack uh, design of electric vehicle battery protection system now these are each and every block is a charger block 
and electrical reference and battery pack and pipe reservoir for coolant purpose all the things you can see when you click on this in the right, right panel, from the light panel you can select the signal to display this plot now this plot is coming is a temperature um, ambient temperature block the same the same thing for this is for reservoir okay, here in this way each and every subsystem you can see the uh, plot is a zero crossing same as, uh, simulation statistics this is a power dissipated voltage in this way you can uh, see each and every every block you can analyze the data okay, i hope you enjoy this video also this is a model parameter define the model parameter values you can see by clicking here you can see the uh, sampling time we have to fix fix, uh, fix this one parameters for uh, lithium ion battery pack example this one the same thing we are using for SLE electrical what, what is the um, temperature you get uh, set means to 278 293 313 this is a T in this vector format and the cell capacity cell capacity vector and the cell state of charge vector you, you can set this one in the same way for uh, proper circuit voltage versus uh, state of charge rows and T columns and uh, cell thermal thermal uh, cell thermal mass and uh, cell level coolant thermal path resistance also you need to give the uh, this type of parameters the battery fault parameters as a voltage and current parameter voltage and current thermal fault parameters okay so in this way you can read this um, example uh, for uh, the design of uh, uh, battery protection circuit uh, system by, uh, uh, during charging and discharging for electric vehicle I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Thank you. If you are new uh, subscriber of my channel, means kindly, okay, if you are viewer of my channel, means kindly subscribe my channel. Please put one uh, like and give them some healthy comments uh, to promote my videos. Thanks for watching. Thank you.